Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another very exciting video here at the Cannes Yachting Festival. To my right, I have David here, who's a very funny young guy. And we're on board the Explorer 62, and David is the son of the owner of the shipyard. And he's been kind enough to give us a tour here on board the yacht. David, thank you very much for doing this. What I would like you to do is just pretend for a second that I'm a potential client and the camera's not here okay. and we're going to do a walkthrough of the boat. Okay, I will ignore the camera and talk to you. Yeah, absolutely. Or you can say, you can say hello to the viewers first. Hi, if you like. I'm David. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Welcome on board. <laughs> right, David, we'll leave right. it to you. We could do the tour as if you were so, doing a tour for a As we're here right now, yep. this is the platform yep. and it can lower under the water. Okay, yeah, yeah. So for me, it's not important, but for my father, because he's a bit older, it's really, really simple to, to step into the water. He's standing on the platform, yep. take the control in the hand, press a button, and then he's going down right into down. the water. water. That's right. amazing. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Another special feature is our garage. We have vertical doors, which basically no one else has it. Yeah. I don't know why. Usually the doors go up like this. That's right. And you and always bang your head. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. It's so stupid, <laughs> I've had it before. Right? Yeah, yeah. I had it before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so you know what I'm talking Absolutely. about. Absolutely. Right? Yeah. And we also uh, decide to have this crystal. Yeah. So you can show your toys. Yeah, yeah. yeah Either absolutely. way, if you have a turbo jet or a jet ski, whatever, you can show them. In the night, we have a little light. Yep. And it looks very beautiful. Okay. So it glows at night. Exactly. Is it like, is it like a colored light? You can it? have a color light. This, light, light. this boat has a white one. Right. You also can have a color one, of course. Very cool. Yeah. Also, our underwater lights are usually colored. Okay. Yeah. Fantastic. I like it so very then much. to launch the tender, the swim platform needs to be down. Exactly. Then you take this. The remote. Remote. Right. And press down. Press the down button. And that's then it, it. Just, it just launches off the back of the boat. Exactly. Fantastic. Very simple. Yeah, that's really, I like that. That's and a nice touch. Also, when you recover the boat, you just put the hook back inside the bo uh, boat, press the button, and it will go in automatically. Very simple. Go. Um, this is fantastic. Another advantage of this door, you can have the uh, crystal right. in a bit darker color. Okay. So you can have a bit more privacy here when you're in the marina. Okay. Exactly. Oh, can you keep it up? Yeah. And you can have it as a pri oh, Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Also in this area, you can have whatever you want. Either way, more toys, what I like to have. Yeah, absolutely. Or like a lounge, a beach club. Yeah, or yeah. either way, just an empty space yeah. with very huge speakers and a light system. But, yeah. <laughs> to have so this is all loose furniture. Exactly. So you, like you said, you can have whatever you want here. Yeah, you can move this. Fantastic. Yeah, this is great. <laughs> and this, considering this is a 62 foot. It's a 62 feet ball. So look at the, the, the sheer volume of deck you're getting here on the yeah. aft deck. It also gives you, because it's all open, it gives you a sense of more space than there probably actually yeah. is. Exactly. May I ask you to have a seat for a second? Absolutely. Okay. Should I sit here at the end of the table? Yes, maybe sit here. Okay. okay. Let me sit here. So I can explain you some things. Something that's quite unique, when you sit here at the dining table, you have a 360 view. Look outside. Imagine you, do, yeah, you yeah. are in a bay. Just as example, in Portofino. Yep. Imagine you have Portofino over there, and then you have an amazing view from here. Yeah, that's a good point. Doesn't matter where you sit. No matter where you look, you've yeah. got views all around. Exactly. That's really interesting. And. Really, you have to experience really this. You have to sit here, yeah. you have to be in a beautiful in a bay, place. And it's like, yeah, because sit on anchor. If you spend this much money and then you take the boat out to go somewhere beautiful, you want to enjoy every single bit of this place. Sure. That's why we decided and said it's so important that you can see everything. Yeah. Because a lot of boats have like walls and stuff. They're like, why? For what reason? Wait. There's no point. You want to see it. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. No, it's beautiful. I see here you have uh, an award on the table. Exactly, you won last year the World Yacht Trophy, actually right. here in Cannes, for right. so the best layout in our size. I can see, congratulations, first of all. I appreciate yeah. it. Uh, Thank you, you, you can very see immediately coming on board. This I've yeah. never seen anything like this. Don't forget, it's 62 feet. 62 feet, yeah. that's insane. So, and what a place to be. For people in our age, this yeah. is 
one of my favorite little gimmick on this boat. Is that it's a, a sink. Yeah. Okay. And under the sink, there's an ice maker. Okay. So you can put the ice in the sink. Right. And put, for example, champagne, champagne. wine, okay. or even seafood. Oh, see, it yeah. looks so beautiful. And then you can have uh, dinner with your family, for example, or friends here, and a party later on here. <laughs> it's uh, perfect. Yeah, it is. Wow. Exactly. Put some cold brewskis in there, some cold champagne. It'd be great. <laughs> yeah, that's true. What a spot. Yeah. Over there, you also have the third, the aft docking station. Exactly. So it's running on IPS drives with that exactly. joystick by Alexa, and you've got a single bow thruster as well. Exactly. So when you're, so guys, when you're docking the vessel here, yeah. so I can see already. You can see all the way down the port side of the vessel, and you can see all the way aft yeah. as well. And docking these things, IPS drives, on the joystick is really simple. Could you try again? Sorry, my watch is talking to me. <laughs> <laughs> really simple. Yeah. You can see, dock the boat, and as you're docking, you can come here, throw exactly. the lines, do the lines, and you need to maneuver the boat, you can then come back here. For again. me, the most important thing here is that you can communicate with the people from the marina. Yeah. You can tell you them, can do chat. this, do that. Sure. First, for example, the wind coming from this side, you can tell them, do this line first, and after that line. Yes, okay. So everything yeah. gets more efficient. Yeah. We have a big fridge here for the drinks. Okay, so you've got an ice maker this side. Yeah, exactly. Fridge this side. Exactly. So it's important because you're, you, want you, to, have, you don't want me to keep going no. you know, three meters to the gallery. No, that's, that's too far <laughs> too away. <complex. laughs> it's too complex. David, please, Thank after you. you. Just look at this opening. So this yeah. this usually will pull over and you just the corners there. here exactly. that are closed and that becomes essentially the superstructure. Exactly. But you've kind of made it part of the deck. The idea was to bring the home to the sea. Absolutely. And that's why we have the big windows from the top to the floor. And this is, this is, this is yeah. again, imagine you are in a beautiful bay. You put the sofa way right out to the corner yeah and then you're laying oh and this yeah. opens up so oh, yeah. you want to jump off you can just jump off exactly that's what i do i put the sofa yeah. there yeah when it's too hot i just roll myself yeah. out of the sofa <laughs> and i'm in the water oh uh, <laughs> wow exactly yeah this is this is something this is, oh, guys i wasn't expecting this that's for sure i'm very <laughs> uh, i'm surprised so, just so sorry, just so the viewers know, I've not seen this, but I've been on this boat before this this video. So this is the first time we're on board the boat. So all the reactions you're seeing is a natural reaction. So the welcome galley. to the ham station and the galley. Yeah. Um, the reason why it's all together, there are, there are two different ways of using. Either way with the family. So for example, the father is driving and the mother is cooking. Right. Or if you have a crew, for example, the stewardess is cooking something, sure. preparing some snacks for you, yeah. and the captain is driving. So either way, it's super separated from, from your area bed in the back, or it's all connected. Absolutely. Super flexible. Yeah. And also, when you're cooking, you get a beautiful view as well. Exactly. And you can open this window completely. <laughs> oh, is that open? This open completely. All the way down. Jeez. Wow. Yeah. So this is the galley and the bridge. Exactly. Yeah. Hmm. Exactly. Yeah. So one thing that's quite special on this boat, we have a stabilization system Yeah. Um, from Humphrey and Seakeeper connected together. You were talking about this today. Oh, is that right? The, the Humphrey and Seakeeper yeah. connected. Okay. We have so connect underway, you've got stabilization. Yeah. Uh, anchor, you've got stabilization. Exactly. And this is exactly what you're just talking about. We have a special software because they are two from two different companies, exactly, right? Yeah. And we have made a, our own software which connect both of them together. So this boat is super stable. Wow, you have your own proprietary yeah. software. Because if you turn it on at the same time, they're not 100% working together. Yeah, they don't calibrate with each other. Exactly. Wow, that is super. Um, so, for example, yesterday I've been on a boat from my friend, right here, the anchor. He has a 37 meter boat. Right. It was quite big. We stayed there for one hour and I told him, no, let's go to my boat. My boat is small, but you will feel like my boat is bigger than yours. He came to this boat and he's like, wow, your boat is not moving. How? <laughs> <laughs> I like and that. he has a 37 meter boat. Wow. wow. A old one, okay. but still. <laughs> well, there you go, viewers. Great. <laughs> this is great. All right. I just love this openness. Yeah, it's very open. I mean, if you think about it, where do you drive boats? Where it's beautiful, so you need the wheel. Secondly, when do you drive? When the weather is good. Yeah. So you open everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You usually don't go when the weather is bad. No, you don't. Yeah. That's what, this is what luxury yachting is about. Exactly. Not heavy, what you want to go to the nice, comfy exactly. places. Walk the way down. Let's go down. 
So this is down to the guest cabin area, is that exactly. right? Do you know Harry Potter? I don't know him personally, but I've no, heard, I've heard <laughs> I do, yes. So the first thing I want to show you is the Harry Potter suite. Ah, the Harry Potter suite. The Harry Potter suite. This is our Harry Potter suite. Okay. So, what is this to give you a bit of background? Um, this is our storage room. Right. For, for example, you have the big suitcases and stuff. So you can put it all here and you don't have to bother with uh, in your cabin. Um, then we were thinking, wait, when you have a boat, you have a lot of friends. <laughs> they want to come and then yeah. enjoy, yeah. enjoy, for example, one week with you. Yeah. Then you never have enough beds. It's so it's not bad to there. have an additional bed. Place to sleep. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Fresh. This is probably for your best friend here. <laughs> exactly. You also have the bathroom here. With the same uh, yes, same layout. Yeah, exactly. That's and you have the television hidden inside this wall. Because inside where? Oh, it's here. Okay, yeah, exactly. Yeah, behind the glass panel. Yeah, yeah exactly. Okay. Nice natural light as well. Nice overhead mm -hmm. lighting. I will explain you. Oh, like the Karada marble effect here. It's nice. Yeah, I will explain Fresh. you why we choose this color in the other room. What the gray? No, or yeah, the marble? I, will, I will explain you over okay. there. Let's, let's go. Let's have a look, guys. Let's go to the. I guess we're going down the master cabin. Exactly. This is a master cabin, and here I'm gonna explain you why we choose the color we chose. So when you enter this room or any other room, everything is white and bright. Yes. And that's very important to have a very open feeling. Sure. Yeah. But when we step to the other side, here, and yeah. look at, at this side of the cabin, everything is black and dark. So look. when you close your eyes and you want to sleep uh, here on the bed, <laughs> that's clever. you have a very comfortable feeling. That's because very if you're clever. looking when you're sleeping at a white wall, it's, it's it, not that perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At yeah. night, you're looking that way. Exactly. But dark. when you enter the room, it's white, so everything feels very spacious. Incredible. Yeah. And then the master bathroom. Exactly. On the side, you also have the option to have um, a beautiful sofa. Or, for example, on our boat, we have there a desk. Right, okay, so work. this can be customized exactly. to the client's requirements. Basically, the entire boat can be customized. Right. You can change the hull, of course, but you can change the layout a bit. You can change all the materials. We have one, for example, with everything in wood. Because okay. the customer wanted sure. it, yeah. you can have like different leather, different color, so we we are able to customize the boat very very much. Yeah, yeah. Uh, she's uh, yeah. I like this this layout. Uh. Wow, 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 wow. Can I look in the bathroom? I love the black marble. It's actually my favorite. Yeah. Also, we try to catch the um, the accents of the black marble with yeah. this brass. Stripes ah, right. all around. Yes, around that makes sense. Exactly. Do you have any questions? I just, I I'm just, I'm see just you to, I'm, looking. Yeah, <laughs> just looking. No, it looks. I mean, it makes. I mean, the boat is really. The layout is really smart. It's very clever. Oh, thank you. Very, very clever. It's a very, very beautiful compliment. It's just. I like your thinking about having as you walk in. It's white light open. Yes. And when you're sleeping, you're looking at a dark wall. Yeah. So it makes perfect sense. Now you have to mention close all the curtains. Cur yeah, yeah, you black it out. Completely it's black. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Yeah. Really nice. Yeah. And what I also notice is you, the bed's a low profile bed. Yes. Which makes the cabin feel bigger. Exactly. That's the reason why. Yeah. That's the reason behind. We, had, um, we have another layout for the cabin where we remove this wall right. and have an uh, open bathroom on the side okay. with two sinks yeah. and an open shower. Okay. That's more for if you have, for example, a young girlfriend. Right. Then it's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. And then only the toilet is closed behind sure. the Sure, yeah, so for the private exactly. toilet. Yeah. Fantastic. Great. I'm very happy that you enjoy this boat. Well, we, I saw it online. I was like, I looked at it. I'm like, I got to see this boat. I couldn't. I, when you look at the, it's, you know, when you look at photos, are you looking at a new house or yeah. a boat or car? The photos never do it justice. Yeah. You got to get on board and get the feeling and the size and. Yeah, I just think it, it's just a cool boat to be with your family and friends. What do you reckon, Dress? Oh, I reckon I could have some fun on you. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's go back upstairs, guys. Here's our wine cooler. 
Cooking. For the wine lovers, exactly. the wine quarter, very good location, I must say. <laughs> yes, because next to the bedroom. If you're with your missus and you're enjoying your evening, you may <laughs> wish to, uh, you know, have a glass of champagne or wine in the cabin. Yeah, so this wink, one wink, Jiminator. <laughs> we, we created like just a small area here mm -hmm. because normally you don't use this area if you're honest. Correct. You just come you're here right. to, to stay here yeah. to make a picture, yeah. maybe like this, like the Titanic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. An Instagram post and you're, <laughs> Instagram and you're done. Instagram post and that's it. But David, can I just say, sorry to interrupt you, you've hit the nail on the head, right? You very rarely get guests using the bow of the vessel. Yes, because they you spend have night of time. On you have the a lot of deck. wind here. Yeah, and <laughs> there's no, there's no shade, so that, but it's exactly. also very sunny. Exactly. And they want to be the deck, and it's yeah. like I said, too much wind. So they want yeah. a drink or lunch. They're always they're always back there. Exactly. It's yeah. more covered in the back. So um, tell me about the, this design here with this. Yeah. Um, so what is for us important when you have guests and you do the mooring? Yes. The mooring and the lines are always dirty. Yes. And you don't want to see it. Yes. That's why it's covered. Okay. And yeah. I don't understand why in the other boats it's never covered. Okay. Only in the big ones. Right. Yeah. You can lift oh, it. Oh, so do you have more cleats under here? Yes, of course. I do. Okay. <laughs> That's actually... Two anchors. And you don't struggle with chafe on the... No. I oh, know you've rounded it off. Wow. So when That's it's a bit, very clever. a bit windy, we put two anchors in the water, yeah. and then we Probably stay not. very stable in the bay. Exactly. And this is access to the anchor locker? No. Or emergency escape? Emergency escape. Okay. Access to the anchor locker is that one. Is that one. Okay. It's waterproof. Great. Exactly. This part here is a design feature. Our CEO... So do you not, like, so the boat would never hit waves? No. No. It would just no. stay above it. We this boat is so stable. Um, yeah. None of the reason why it's so stable. We are, um, have been able to put the fuel tank, yeah. the fresh water tank, yeah. and the grey water tank right in the center of the boat right, yeah. at the bottom. Yeah. We don't have the standard stainless steel boat. We have a customized tank, um, which is like handmade for our product here. Wow. And that, for example, when you have three tons of fuel in the center of the boat, it gets very stable. Let's go, guys. Look at the stairs. This is nice. I like this. You won't expect this. On Hi. 62. Hello. Maybe let's move to the back first. Yeah, absolutely. So. After you, camera. This area here yeah. is like in, uh, downstairs in the back. You can put whatever you want here. This customer choose like some beds. Yeah. For the people who love the sun, but we also can put some gym equipment, for example. Right. Here. Yeah. 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 So it's very flexible. It's not fixed. What is here? Then this one is important to me. That's the bar. <laughs> <laughs> Babe and I can become good friends. I can, I, I can tell you guys. Well, you, I would. Do you know what I would do? Because this is like you said. This is the bar. I'll make. This is me personally. Everybody's different. You just make it all complete social area. Yes, exactly. More, more That's seating, possible. and you probably put like a bimini here with two poles. Have it shaded. Have the bar. Have your music playing. That's definitely possible. Yeah. yeah. If you want to buy one, we can customize yeah. this as you want. <laughs> <laughs> if you finance it, no problem. <laughs> So, and also here we have an uh, electric grill, uh, a sink. Hold on, does this, does this yeah. fall down? Yeah, when you don't need it, you mm -hmm. fall down. That's clever. For example, after you, you did barbecue, yeah, yeah. you don't want to clean it right afterwards. So you just close it, hide yeah. it for you can't see a couple it of there. hours, and it's completely clean and beautiful. Yeah. And under here we have two fridges for drinks. Okay, two fridges? Yes, one is oh. not enough. Yeah. You never have enough fridges on a boat. No, you don't. <laughs> this guy. All right. And then, huh? Right. So, so please yeah, take continue. a seat over there. Right, yeah. I will show you something that I really love about this boat. Here, now you have something for your bag. Try. It's not, and it's stable. <laughs> it doesn't fall. <laughs> and you That's can great. remove it when you don't need it. That's fantastic. So it's very flexible, this area. And the visibility when you dock it. Oh, yeah. Nice when you do the docking, what I usually do personally, I sit here, yeah. try to sit. Okay. No, sit here. 
Oh, you sit on the thing? Yes. And you're like this? Then I put my arm this way. Yeah. Because I don't want to fall. fall. Yeah. And then you can use the joystick. Okay. And you have personal visibility to the back. Ah, oh, so you like this. Exactly. Ah, I see. Yeah, yeah. So you like, um. And um, when this board is coming to a marina, everyone is looking. Yeah, yeah. And you look super cool when you sit like yeah. this. And park the board. <laughs> <laughs> That's really important. It that is. It is. Really, I'll tell you. I'll tell you a story. Actually, we were going to Bonifacio once on the boat, and it was blowing. Corsica. In Corsica. Yes, so we went there last week. You were there? With, with, with this boat? No, okay. with the boat that's in Anchor. We have two boats here. Right, okay. Yeah. Uh, we went, I've been going there for years, but we were there particularly maybe about 10 years ago. Yeah. And um, I was running a boat and it was blowing like 25, 30 knots. Wow. On the beam. I said, so I had one crew member on board. I said to the owner, I'll need your help with fenders. Yeah. It's just so windy, you know. And obviously you're a little bit, not nervous, but you're a bit anxious, like what's going to happen. He turns around, he says, Tris, don't worry about the thing. The most important thing is you look cool while you're doing it. <laughs> If you crashed a boat, you crashed a boat, but make sure you look cool. <laughs> like, hey, sweet. I love that I was relaxed, we docked the boat, no problem at all. So I see what you mean, this is actually a nice little entrance yeah. here. And you feel safe because of the pool. You do, yeah, yeah, everything yeah. happens. Exactly. Yeah. And you've got additional seating here. Exactly. Wow. Can I go and sit on this? Yes, of course. Of course. So you can be driving. And yeah. you can sit here. I will come. Oh, perfect. Look at that. Now imagine you nice you're, you're driving cruising. maybe in the night yeah. and the moon rises. Lovely. Or the sun goes down, the sunset. Absolutely. Or the sun rises. Basically nice anything is beautiful breed. here. Yeah, anything on the boat. Chorus. So tell us about this. Um, we have a hardtop here. Right. And all the technique is above there. But when you have people who love the sun, you can open it. So this is fully retractable. Oh, no, it rotates. Exactly. That's cool. The reason why it's like this is, for example, when it's extremely hot. Yeah. And you know the wind is, for example, right now, it's coming from the back. You direct the winds down to this area. So it creates a... Exactly. A fan. A natural fan, yes. But I prefer to close it right now. It's yeah, quite okay. hot. It's really warm. Close it. <laughs> All right, let's take a seat and ask some technical questions. Let's put, what do you reckon, we should put David on the spot now. Yeah, let's do it. See how well he knows this boat. Oh, is this? I feel like I'm back in school. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, so performance. Yes. Tell us about the propulsion system, what you're running with this boat. So we, we decided to choose Volvo. Right. Penta. Yep. And we have the D8. Okay. installed on this boat, two engines. Um, the engine is called D8-800, yep. and we have 600 horsepower each. Right, okay. So um, what is quite amazing about this boat, when you drive about nine to 10 knots, yep. you consume less than 50 liters, including the generator, 50 liters per 50 hour. 50 liters at 10 knots? Yeah. Total? Total. Including the generator. Including the generator. What's your fuel tank size? Uh, 2,700 liters. So how many hours is that of cruising? That's going to be 20, 27 hours yeah. of cruising on a 63? Yes, 62. <laughs> 62, sorry. 62. Even smaller, 62. <laughs> exactly. Okay. The, so the generator, you have a single generator. Yeah, a single one. Okay, and that can easily power all the boats when you're exactly. at anchor. That will include the stabilizers, the fridges, the AC, powers everything. Yeah, you, you can turn everything on and you don't have a problem. Our generator is big enough. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. Okay. Uh, water maker. We have our water maker here. So you make your own yes. uh, reverse osmosis? So yeah, exactly. Okay. So you can be completely self-sufficient yes. on the boats? You can stay at anchor for one week with no problem at all. Top speed? Top speed, 22 knots. 22 knots. And so, crew, like, I know you said 10 knots, the fuel consumption is very low. So cruising on this boat would be, what, 18, 19 knots if you push it? So if you if you push the cruising speed, it's about 16, 17 knots. 16, 17 knots. But okay. usually, um, at least what we do, we're not going beyond 12 knots. Yeah, okay, because you want to keep that range. Exactly. 
That makes most sense. So the, the, really the design of this boat, like you said, is Explorer, more long range, yeah. slower speed, comfortable cruising. Comfortable and safety. And, and the safety, safety side. Safety is very important to us. Yeah. Everything we do, we always consider the safety of this boat yeah. and all the passengers. Right, okay. Yeah. So um, maybe a little funny background story because we are quite new in the market. Yeah. Um, our prototype, we took it and did a test crash. Okay. Full speed against the wall. It, people say we are crazy. You drive a yeah. actual test boat. Yeah. Prototype. Full speed. Full speed against the wall. Into a wall. Yes. Okay. If you buy a car, you yeah. also want to know that it has been crash tested. Yeah. It's been normal to everyone nowadays. And why not with boats? We don't understand. For us, like yeah. seriously, it's not yeah. a joke. For us, it's very important that this boat is safety, that we know we are selling a product yeah. where we can be sure that we did everything we could, that our customers are safe. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah. So, the, the, so tell us about the structure then. So what makes this so strong? So uh, we have fiberglass yeah. and our fiberglass is really thick. Okay. Which makes the boat heavy yep. and for us expensive to produce because right. of the material. Okay. But we say for us, like the quality of the boat is so much more important yep. than to have more profit, for example. Sure. Yeah. Okay, so, so is any carbon fiber integrated into Actually, the... Actually, yeah, this is all carbon fiber. So the sun tops entirely, yeah. okay. So, also, so um, you're keeping the center of gravity low, because exactly. that's going to be lighter. The heavy stuff's on the hull. Exactly. So it'll be more stable at sea. Also here, the things that are black is carbon fiber. Right. Yeah. Everything is black. So the poles are carbon fiber. This one, no, this is steel. Oh, the structure. But I mean, this one. That's all carbon fiber? Yes. Wow. And below, it's fiberglass. Uh, yes, right. exactly. Fantastic. Okay. The draft of the boat is should be 1.5 or 1.7. Okay. So you can go actually quite shallow if you want to yes. go into shallow waters. What I love to do is put the two anchors in the front yeah, yeah. and then take two ropes in the back and put it at shore. You spend too much time in Croatia, my friend. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> That's what we do in Croatia, baby. <laughs> yeah. It's beautiful. It's yeah. beautiful. And then the boat is like stable on the move. And if you need, you put the stabilization system on. And then, and then just it's nothing. like a house. It's like a house. Perfect. David, dude, it's been a pleasure meeting you. Thank you for the tour. My I'm pleasure. sure the viewers are going to actually, you guys are going to love him more than you love me. <laughs> if you do enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up. Thumbs I put up. links to their Instagram, their website, all in the description box below. That would be nice. Um, and if you do inquire, make sure you mention, you know, the Super Yacht Captain, Yours guys. Truly. Yours truly. Thank you all so much for watching, Dave. Thanks again. Guys, see you all next time. And arrivederci. Ciao. Goodbye. Ciao.